on that rather powerful and thought-provoking song uh, into just a moment I'd like to relate a little story that somewhat in front of me but it's actually coming directly from my heart. Uh, this story is about a, a song. Uh, years ago, in 1969, after a long, long night, I believe driving back from either Glasgow or Newcastle, uh, back from a gig way up north, I was uh, driving. Aye, aye. And uh, back in those days, we didn't know about coffee or anything else, so I was looking for a way to keep awake. And I put the radio on as we came near to London town, uh, basically to keep me awake. And I heard the Beatles. Uh, they were talking about uh, an album that had come out yeah, uh, in that uh, period of time. In fact, that day, Abbey Road. And uh, I think it was George, maybe John, they were talking about a beautiful song called Sun King. Yes. And uh, I didn't really register apart from my eyes split open and I woke up. And uh, the, the whole moment was, was profound to be hearing uh, a band that, that had really made their mark on the world why they even had heard of, of, of us bunch. And they said quietly, either George or John, said, this is where we do our, our albatross thing, like Fleet Mac. <laughs> and, 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 and the whole band, you know, even the lads in the back that were asleep. So uh, we, our minds were truly blown. And uh, I think we need to move on a little bit here. <laughs> ah. <laughs> but uh, to know that uh, this uh, floating lovely song had inspired just a little bit of, of something so precious as the band who was talking on the radio. And uh, this next beautiful song, Albatross, uh, written by Peter, uh, I would like to dedicate not only to Peter Green, but Yay! to George Harrison, perhaps for his birthday today.